one great thing is I am so impressed with our local guys. Yeah. Jan and Amazing. Diego, they're super hard working, really, really good wildlife spotting. I think they're going to be gold dust. Nice, nice. Look at the size of that. Look at the teeth on it as well. This wolfish is very, very good eating. Uh, and this will be smoked over the fire. It's an ancient Amerindian way of preserving fish in this tropical climate. Do you leave this smoking all night? Yeah, all night, till all the night. morning. So it'll be ready for breakfast. Yeah. But the commotion and the smell of blood in the water attracts predators into camp. Oh, look at this, look at that one. Look at that one, right, Green? Holy moly. That's amazing. Jan? Jan, can I get the net, please? <laughs> well done. Yeah, yeah, I'm watching, watching, watching. I'm not going to do it any harm being out of the water for a short period of time, but it could do us a lot of harm. Stingrays are in the shark family. They're essentially just a completely squashed freshwater shark, but they don't bite you. Instead, they sting. Oh, I'd be so, so careful doing this. And the tail here, which comes down, to a stinger, the barb itself is serrated, incredibly sharp, and as it lashes through the wound, it leaves behind a venom that creates enormous pain. I've met people who've stepped on these stingrays and been stung and have lost complete use of their leg and lost enormous amounts of tissue. And they're here in these rivers in numbers that I have simply never seen before. There are absolutely thousands of them. Right, so I'm gonna get them back in the water. 